Okay, hey, let's move on. Brendan, you know all about this. West Texas, we all know rain is hard to come by out here. But out in far West Texas, there's been so much rain. It's created something that has not been seen in those parts for 10,000 years. Brendan, you saw it with your own eyes. These images are incredible, by the way. Yeah, they're almost surreal. Over 10 inches of rain fell in the area of the Guadalupe Mountains this summer, Tatum, and that's a lot for this part of the world. And the water, you know, it has to go somewhere. So, you know, I thought, you know, why not go see it for myself? And I'll admit, though, I was a little surprised, but in a good way at what I found. Way out west, along Highway 62 in Hudspeth County, in the shadow of El Capitan, lie the salt flats of West Texas. Out here in the middle of the desert is the last place you'd expect to have a beach day. We drove out from El Paso just to, you know, come out something a little different, you know. Little beach we have here. I mean, uh, it's pretty cool, you know. It was. Something different. Different, that's one word to describe it. In a normally dry and desolate stretch of desert, now sits a little oasis. It's fun, I mean, we were just hanging out for a little bit, playing volleyball, you know, just hanging out with the kids. Really like any outing to a regular lake. It's kind of nice too because it's not deep though, you know what I mean, it's a nice little shallow. So it's not, you don't have that risk of like, oh, you know, the kids going out too far. People came from all corners of West Texas to experience the new lake for themselves. Much of the lake is on private property, However, the water from the edge of the highway to the property line is fair game, and people are taking full advantage of the new lakefront property. From swimming to tossing a football to inflatable rafts, it just doesn't feel like West Texas. History will tell you the lake dried up some 10,000 years ago, creating the salt flats, and it's never significantly filled since. That was until this summer. Heavy rains filled it back up to a little over a foot. Almost magical in a place where, a lot of years, rainfall's pretty hard to come by. Yeah, and rain is no guarantee here. Like yeah, <laughs> never, never that. I mean, it's it's horrible, especially, I mean, like I said, I'm born and raised in El Paso and living in Odessa. And, I mean, it rains out there and I'm out there playing in the, in the street with the water, you know, so it's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. An oasis in the middle of the West Texas desert. So pretty cool indeed, but as cool as this is, the Hudspeth County Sheriff's Office is warning people not to venture onto private property. Large groups of people have shown up to visit this lake and they want to warn people who trespass, you will be cited. Still, Tatum though, it's pretty awesome to see things like this.